Yo, what is up, guys? Vision Hoodie here, man. We back. Back today with another video. Um, Today, I'm going to be in the Gun Bunch tight end mini scheme. A lot of people have been asking me, uh, you know, some people have been asking me how, you know, some Gun Bunch tight end mini scheme. People have been asking me to do, you know, see how I play ball or Dolphins. And basically, they're like the same thing. So I got y'all today. I'm just going to show you guys um, a scheme. You know, see how to see how scheme. I don't know why I said mini bunch tight end. But basically, guys, I'm showing you guys today. We're going to be in. Uh, Seattle Seahawks. That's gonna be today's, you know, one of the best offenses in the game, man. One of the best offenses in the game. You got bunch tight end, and you also got bunch weak. Um, so personally, for me, when I'm, if, for me, since I'm making this, I, I'm gonna be basing it off bunch. You know what I mean? Um, bunch tight end and bunch weak. Uh, there's a lot of great plays in this bunch week play. Actually, there's a lot of great plays in this bunch week. Um, they have matched one of my favorite plays, especially what I love to do is a cover two look. I'm gonna show you guys that. And then they got these clothes to where you can just, you can easily just, uh, <laughs> audible with these clothes. <clears throat> you can easily just audible with these clothes. You have also stretch. So that's what I really love about this, um, deuce clothes in this playbook. That's also what I love about it. And then you also have, do they also have single back white chips? Or is it Dolphins? Not Dolphins, I'm single back white chips. Uh, then, yeah. So that's basically what I'm going to be, um, primarily going to be focusing on in this, you know, little, little ebook. You know, little, see how, see how ebook. Also, they got trip tight and offset, like, this is not bad at all, to be honest. I've seen people run out of this. I want to try a pretty good run. Uh, but I'm going to focus more on this, you know, I'm not going to try to go over too many different formations. I'm going to go over, you know, uh, two formations. Definitely going to go over a bunch of plays and going to go over a bunch of tight end plays. It's going to show some bombs and then show some dots, you know, against certain coverages and whatnot. Um, and then I'm just going to, yeah, that's basically going to be, you know, th just showing you guys this, this is how you get sneaky. Make sure y'all go check out, you know, all my other ebooks. Check out that ebook series. It's been a grind, man. I haven't posted in uh, probably like three, four days. I've been going through a lot. Um, it's been hard for me. My mic has been having problems. So we're just going to go ahead, though, and today we're going to start off with, we're just going to go ahead and get uh, Gun Bunch tied in. We're going to get Gun Bunch tied in, and we're going to just go do it against, you know, certain type of, yeah, certain type of looks, certain type of coverages. We're going to start off with Tampa 2 coverage. Um, now, a lot of times, if, we're gonna be, if you're going to be in a, this Bunch tight end look, I think I, I forgot to swap Curl Black Corner. I don't run Curl Black Corner. Uh, the only thing I don't like about this Seattle play look is they don't have the tight end corner play. But they do have this play. This play is very, very good. Uh, a lot of times, I like they have two drags. I like to have two drags most of the time. Um, a lot of times, I'll streak this guy. If they don't have a deep boot, then this is just going to be an easy touchdown. You guys should already know what's going to be wide open. Um, uh, no, 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 no. That's my fault. I passed that. I need to pass through that down the middle of the field. So we're going to go ahead and try that again. We're going to go ahead and try it again because I'm going to show y'all how that's a touchdown. Easily, easily a touchdown against a cover two with no deep blue. That's just my fault right there. I passed let it. Um, I didn't really pass lead it. Boom. There we go. That's how it is. We got dots. <laughs> so right there, straight up, cover two look. If there's no deep blue, say less. You know, that's going to be too easy. But most people don't do that. Most people are not going to do this. So you don't worry about that. But you also got inside zone in this playbook. Inside zone and um, inside zone. Is, is very good run play already, but in the gun bunch tight end, it's even better because the blocks and gun bunch tight end that you get is, is very crazy. Um, it's very crazy, you know. The blocks you get out of this is very crazy. Now, this is rags, um, and right now, you know, it might not you might not get as much as you want, but you guys can see once you get that, you know, oh my god, you have someone that's very, very shifty as well. You guys will be straight, man. You guys, you guys are gonna definitely be straight, you guys are very, very sticky. So, that's also another play you could really run. A lot of times when I'm going to run this play, I'm going to, you know, make that running, running back go into, you know, a table route. I'm going to make that running back go into a table route. Uh, I will fade this tight end against a cover two look. I'll fade this tight end. I'm going to drag Baldwin. And then that's basically what I'm going to do. I'm going to drag Baldwin. Uh, what else do I do? I can't really. I think I'm like, I, I'm motion side receiver right here. And I put a drag so that, like, I can drag the user. I can make the user, you know, have to choose where he wants to go. And then I can leave, you know, we're over top low ball dot you know what i mean that's what i love to do against the cover two look a lot of the time so just pay attention you know that's what i like to do a lot once again we're in um now we're in inside switch sometimes i'll either block my running back <coughs> fade his running back so he can pull away the deep blue i mean sometimes i, I could just leave that flat <coughs> by baldwin i could just leave that flat you know what i mean and sometimes i also can do this this is also another setup i can do against this look um another great setup i can do you know what i mean put him this guy all into the flats i have a motion you know the um triangle receiver and then boom you guys see i'm dining up so make sure y'all paying y'all paying attention make sure y'all paying attention because i tend to move a little fast uh so you know i tend to move fast so just make sure you pay attention we keep replaying if you guys are really interested in this playbook keep replaying um you know, the setups and rock combinations and whatnot here we go again though i'm showing you guys another setup the same setup again you know this is also another great setup 
you know, boom. Uh, deep down the middle is gonna be a deep blue. Now, if it's deep blue, it doesn't matter because it's wide open against deep blue. Because deep blue is gonna be already straight going down straight in the middle of the field. Deep blue is not gonna be, you know, sh right there to get that. So that's gonna be a dot every single time. Um, right there, boom. Then I'm gonna show y'all again. You, you, you can block anybody, and if they don't have a deep blue, then this is just an easy touchdown. I'm just saying, people still don't run with deep blues. <laughs> people don't, especially if you're playing bunt and you're like in like. And you're not really, you know, you're not on matter first string, all pro first string, pro first string. You're starting off in like rookie first string. You're gonna be playing with people if they're running tapping too. I'm, I'm so serious, bro. <laughs> so that's something that you're gonna be doing, you know, against, you know, cover two looks. I'm just showing you guys plays. Now this, the gun bus doesn't really have a lot of plays like that. Uh, so I'm just telling y'all, man, make sure, you know, uh, a lot of times also just make sure you're flipping your plays. Make sure you know how to attack different sides of the field with your routes you know make sure you're doing that make sure you're doing that man because y'all will know what's gonna happen make sure y'all doing that man because y'all gonna know what's gonna happen like i'm so serious y'all gonna know exactly what's gonna happen once y'all do that so you guys have to be able to so basically once you know y'all switch y'all plays back and forth that can really you know mess up people's adjustments and whatnot if you're switching plays and whatnot um curl flat corner i don't really run this play like that uh, a lot of times i really don't but if i do this is the adjustments i would make against it i would, I would make these adjustments a lot of times i make these adjustments to just drag my tight ends too simple to drag. um i would put that you know uh in, you know if no one I don't run this i really don't run this at all i don't run you know curl flat corner at all so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna make sure, you know, I don't um, have that in there. You know, if I'm running this playbook, I don't run that, so I can't really, you know, I'm not gonna really tell y'all, you know, stuff out of this play, and I don't really run it. <laughs> so, um, yeah, that's basically it. We're gonna, um, I'm also gonna be showing, what else do we have in this playbook? Well, I don't really run curl flat corner. That's that's basically what I got, all I gotta say, honestly, is. Often, I also have off, HP off tackle. I have two good runs I can just, you know, I can all about two just, just like that. You know, inside zone and inside split. So that's that's already you know some stuff I guess to cover two look that I just showed y'all. Now we're gonna be in bunch week and this is gonna be fun, man, because I have a lot of plays in the bunch week that you know you guys should are. It's basic simple stuff that you guys should, should know against any type of other you know any other type of um you know any other type of bunch you know certain you know adjustments you make you know most of the time. Again, I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all though what I really like to do, uh, especially out of mesh. Honestly, I like to do this where I would like to roll out, max protect everybody, roll out. Um, most, most of this inside receiver, just, and then just roll out. Roll out of the pocket, and then, you know what I mean? Oh, you're gonna have a dot every single time. Every single time it gets a cover two look, you roll out of the pocket, make sure you just roll out, you wait, step in the pocket, you know what I mean? Step up, stop, you know, and just throw it. Like, make sure you pass lead. Sometimes you might pass lead it. And this will open these things, though. 99.9% of the time. Like as you guys can see, I'm rolling out. You can see, I'm gonna stop, and then I'm passing it. Boom! Every single time it gets to cover two, look, this will be wide open, man. Every single time this will be wide open. I'm gonna show y'all again. <laughs> Same setup. This is what I really love to do against two. Look. Honestly, I do this so much now. Um, like I said, you know, I'm just gonna roll out. You know, just stop in the pocket, just pass lead it. Boom! You guys see just how hot it is. <laughs> we hot. We hot, man. So that's what I really love to do with our favorite setups. Then you have PA post. Um, there's so many setups you can do out of PA post, honestly. I use so many, I'm gonna show you guys. This is like the, the basic setup, you know, people are doing, especially in the start of the year. You have two drags. Defense give you two drags, boom. You have the C route, then you have over top. Another adjustment you could do, honestly, is um, I've seen people, you just, you know, streak, streak this, you know, streak the tight end. So you can pull away, you know, whoever. And then a lot of times people just, they'll either like, you know, Leave this drag on this side, motion out. That's also what you know you could do. And just, and that's yards. That's three. You know, every time. You know, if that's as long as the drag is always gonna be open, that's what they like to do, man. Or another setup they could do is instead of leaving the drag on this side, do it on this side, and then a playmaker. You know what I mean? So if you guys really like playmakering, then you guys, you guys will have fun. You know what I mean? Like, like just look at that, bro. Right there, this is bad playmaker because um, I, this is rags. So I forget they don't cut quick. They don't cut quick. But I'm just showing y'all a pure example. Now, the thing about this, though, Gun Bunch Week is, I don't like, is they have HB base play. <laughs> That's the only run play they have. HB base is, like, I don't really, I, I, I think HB base is one of the worst run plays in the game. So, that's what they have. Um, we're going to go ahead and fix these audibles, though. 
because I have space in right here and I thought I fixed the audible so we're gonna go ahead and fix the audible if you really really look at the run Seattle playoffs then uh, just pay attention man um space in, is not it space is not it Z spot is a pretty good play um we're gonna go ahead and do Z spot and go that's a very good play and yeah uh we also have a really good deep bomb out of here though we have a, a, a deep bomb you know bunch of drills a good deep bomb we're gonna go ahead and show that against a cover three look i'm just gonna show y'all some, some i'm gonna show you some bombs man cover three look that's all you guys gotta do you know you know what i mean that's all you guys gotta do is a cover three look like like for real this is all you got a cover three look man boom dot <laughs> like that's all you guys gotta do is a cover three look this is it's straight up that straight up straight up the only thing you make is put the guy in the out route on the right side of the field and gets a cover three look that's all you're gonna do make sure you have time in the pocket right there i messed up um right there accidentally i forgot to put the guy in the out route that's my fault i forgot to put the guy in the out route all right there we go okay i don't know why they're doing a hitch that's kind of wild they make it you know the square is still wide open though that still works with that concept actually that's crazy that still works with that concept that's wild that's really really wild coach but as you guys can see once again we're just gonna do this out route we're just gonna do it. Make sure I pass like boom dot. You know, if that's as long as you have time in the pocket and you got that, you know, you got that out route right there. You just you have time, there's gonna be a dot every single time, man. It's gonna be dots, 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 dots. Every single time it's gonna be a dot. So that's a that's a bomb I already showed you out. Then you guys spot and go. Like I said though, um you guys always put your guys on the on a mini on this on mini tape this is a table route. Because for some reason AI plays the ball really, really well if you leave it this on that like going, you know, if you leave them that running back on that, you know, that normal route. They play the ball so much better so that, that's why i advise you guys to do that um a lot of times what i like to do is I like to, i like to, i keep this base a lot of times you know unless i drag the c route a lot of times i just keep this base honestly i just keep this base and a lot of times just you know boom but you know if they have hard flats um cloud flats you know you'll notice you'll notice man if they're playing hard flats you know what i mean if they're playing hard flats you're gonna hit you're gonna hit to the running back um no you're not if they play cloud flats you're gonna hit to the running back if they're playing hard flats you're gonna hit that c route so one one of each is always gonna be wide open so as long as you're just being progressive for your reads and whatnot, you let it, as long as you have time, as long as you have time, man, because I don't have time right now. I should have uh, put the setting on just having time in the pocket just so I can show y'all. But once again, you know, this bunch, you know, this playbook honestly is, it's all right. I mean, it's, it, it's probably one of the best playbooks still in the game for, for sure, like for people especially. Um, but for me personally, I don't really like Seattle playbook. Like, I don't really like the gun bunch plays and whatnot. Uh, Seattle ha definitely have a good, you know, I like, they have good much tight end though, you know, they, they have good much tight end, Seattle is, you know, way more known for having good much tight end, but as you guys can see, you know, if they take that hard flat, boom, you're gonna have, a f you, you're gonna have, boom, you're gonna have that over top, if they play, if they play hard flats, so you're gonna have that over top, every single time, and then, like I said, you guys are gonna have that bomb, every single time, y'all gonna have that bomb, y'all gonna have this bomb every single time as well, as these spot and go, now, I don't know, if it's gonna work this way, let's just see. We're gonna have to see if this works this way. You just put this out right here. Uh, I don't know if I should motion it or not. I don't know what, I, I forgot what I do. Nah, you don't do that. You don't do that, all right, bet. I think you motion it, or I think it's just, nah, this is a whole different play. So we're gonna go ahead and try that one second. Hold on one second, y'all. Let's just see if this works. Cause I'm pretty sure it's a play that I run out of my playbook and it's like similar and it works, you know, just like the same setup, it works. Nah, it's not working. All right, they're not letting me. They're not. They're not. It's not working that way. <laughs> so don't even mind that. But gets cover three. Look, that's it. Now I'm gonna go ahead, go back in gun much tight end. We're gonna go back to inside switch. Um, and there's a lot of things I like to do at an inside switch. Uh, gets a cover three. Look, a lot of times I just you know I'm a fade this receiver, try to get him away. Sometimes I just leave that corner route because that corner route could get wide open and gets a cover three. But you gotta make sure you low ball that. Make sure you low ball that. Like really make sure y'all low ball because. Um, those corner routes get played like they, they get played so well, bro. And every time it gets, you know, cover three look, most of the time, make sure you check the flats. Most of the time, you know, cover three look, the flats gonna be wide open every single time. Uh, go again inside switch. That's literally a setup I like to do against a cover three. Fade the inside receiver so you can pull away, you know, some of those guys. Pull away those guys. Uh, R1, put them on, you know, table route. And just look, you guys, you guys are gonna see, man. You guys are gonna definitely see. Um, boom, pass led, dot. You know what I mean? Um, I pass led at that, that time because that you know that linebacker was right underneath that. So it's just simple things you guys gotta make sure you do. You know, which is uh, AKA you know pass leading. Um, that also really helps because the guy could be in position, but if you pass lead a certain way, you know what I mean, you're gonna be gushy. <laughs> it don't matter. <laughs> it don't matter. So we're gonna go ahead. I'm gonna show y'all you know a little bomb out of this play. I just love I just love showing bombs. You know what I mean? Like that's that's something I like to do. Most of this making a lot, man. That's all you guys gotta do. Um, and you got how easy that is. Boom, dot. Simple, <laughs> simple, man. We just showing y'all.
dots after dots after dots after dots after dots. This ebook's not gonna be that long because um compared to all my other ebooks, just because the fact is, is my mic's kind of messed up and I don't want my mic to just keep messing up and you guys don't really get as much. And plus, I don't really you know. I'm still like not really I'm still figuring out how to run this playbook as much, but I'm just I know already This will help you guys you guys are paying attention already It will help you guys, you know develop other other reads other route combinations You guys will know what plays to start off with if you guys having trouble and etc man So we're gonna go ahead. I'm gonna show y'all HB off tackle Um, and then you know, I'm gonna show y'all a couple four. Just gonna show y'all a couple four now a lot of these same route combinations work against you know the same you know same coverages a lot a lot of the rock companies work the same man so if you guys don't see me do the same setup against a certain coverage this most of the time it's gonna, it's gonna work against any other type of coverage so that's really what i like to do like i said though the only reason i don't really like this playbook as much is not as diverse if you're gonna just run like gum bunch of stuff you gotta really make sure you mix it up really good unless you just you got good reads like that man if you're gonna have good reads like that every single time if you're gonna just have good boom truck them you're gonna have good reads and you just really, 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 you making sure, you know, you got, making sure you call the right place at the right time, then yeah, you'll be unstoppable in this playbook. But personally, I just feel like, like, Gun Bunch Titan, uh, and at least in this playbook, um, needs better, you know, needs way more more plays, you know what I mean? It doesn't really have that many plays. Like, Bunch, the reason why Bunch is so pop, so so successful, because there's so many plays you can run out of Gun Bunch, you know what I mean? And so and be so effective. Uh, like, this Gun Bunch Titan would be so way more effective, at least in Seattle Seattle's playbook, if they had way more plays. But... You know, that's just a whole nother topic. Then we also have Mesh. Once again, Mesh, this this rock combination. I love this rock concept, you know what I mean? I just love fading the outside receiver, motion him. Uh, then I'm just gonna roll out, end up rolling out. Or you don't you know if they don't have if you don't have that much time in the pocket, you know, you just gonna pass lead this. Like, like I told y'all, bro. I told y'all, juke him for the one time. Pre patch dude coming back. <laughs> I told y'all, man. That pass lead is so nasty. <laughs> that pass lead is so nasty. We're gonna go ahead though. I'm going to show you guys um Let's see if it works this way. This dot. Nah, it doesn't. All right, well, I'm gonna show you guys one more time that bunch trail bomb. Like I said, I love I love showing bombs, man. I love showing bombs. Um, are we in? Yeah, there we go. This is all you're gonna do, you know, a bunch trail, motion. Leave, you can leave that corner off if you want to, honestly. And you just gonna have to make it right there. I don't have no time in the pocket. So that's just on me. I personally, I need to be able to, you know, put a setting where I can just have time. Cause you know, I'm, I mean, but then the good thing about this though is the fact is, is that it's gonna really show people like boom that's a dot um right there he just drops it you know unfortunately he drops that that's an easy touchdown that's an easy touchdown um the only good thing though about this is because you're gonna be playing these people who actually really send pressure on you so that's really a good thing but this is rags and this Seattle Seahawks line is horrible you know it's very very horrible so anyone's gonna come in very very fast you know especially like Jimmy Graham is just having trouble like Jimmy Graham literally is just struggling like imagine that bro he's struggling struggling against Geno so I'm just gonna go ahead and do this one more time, man. Um, I'm not gonna try to keep getting sacked over and over and over and over. And then, yeah, we're just gonna go ahead, boom, there we go. <laughs> there we go, man. There we go, coach. Uh, that's basically gonna be you know, the bomb. I showed y'all plenty of time. I showed y'all a lot of tutties already out of this. So I'm gonna go ahead, Z spawn go, like I said, you know, a lot of times make it, just, just do that, you know? I can sometimes just drag this. Um, either sometimes I use the motion on the same side as in this clear. Or you know whatnot, or I'll just do you know right there. Oh my goodness, they played the ball so well right there. They played the ball so well right there. Uh, I had to wait to throw that. That's just oh, that's just me. Um, a lot of times I also could just match protect. You got, but but you know what I mean. If you're gonna match protect, you gotta make sure you really make sure you have three good routes on the field. That's gonna at least you making sure you got to read. You know, like I said, make sure you have you know um, <laughs> make sure you also playmaker. If you really like to playmaker, sometimes you're gonna have to do the, the little playmaker. You know, a lot of pros be doing that. They'll just be playmaker people have three routes on the field playmaker someone like for instance they have this drag they'll motion this drag and if, if that user's on that drag and everything else is kind of locked up they'll try to you know motion that motion that away you know what i mean they'll try to motion that away just throw it away i'm just just trying to show y'all a pure example it's not mutt though so you can't really playmaker as easily as you want to but i'm just showing you a pure example if you guys get the point um once again though you got there's a lot of things you could do you know you can motion you can motion this way etc etc now if you guys you know this corner route is going to get open almost every time if they're going to keep playing you know car flash or whatnot that will be wide open you know what i mean that corner route will be like just wide open so wide open you know what i mean so that's just something you guys got to really pay attention to um you can leave the drag, you can leave this, you know, you can leave that flat, you can leave, and then, you know, let's just make sure you just make it your reads, man, pay attention, you, just look to learn off of what I'm showing y'all, man, look to learn off what I'm showing y'all, I don't really run this, though, the scheme, so it's kind of hard for me, I had to kind of lab some plays up for y'all, so I probably look a little, you know, have some, some look a little ruggish, but I'm sure I got y'all, man, I love y'all, and y'all, y'all want to see this, so we're gonna go ahead, um, right there, boom, like I said, pass lead, 
like the pass leads are just are so deadly you know people don't do that those pass leads will get open so much against certain coverages like people would think everything's locked up then boom i'd be like nah coach <laughs> die dot so we're just dying 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 you know every single time just showing you how easy little read easy little dots that you have that you could take your power is just has no spin whatsoever you know these uh, short routes you know you guys gotta make sure you guys are always always looking at reading those first you know what i mean Woo, woo, carson i see you that's been moved hb base of this person. the only run play go much weak you know what i mean that's the only um run play that they have so I'll show you another setup you guys could do. You don't have to just always fade. You know, once again, match protect, or you can put this guy with people blitzing, 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 yeah. blitzing, blitzing, yeah. just blitzing, blitzing, blitzing. Well, guess what? <laughs> you guys match protect. You guys have way much. Y'all see a way much difference between match protect out of bunch because bunch is just a whole nother level, bro. Bunch is a whole nother level. Like literally, you could match protect. That's literally one of the formations. You really could just match protect, and you could literally have a lot of time in the pocket. You know what I mean? So we're gonna go ahead though. And we're gonna get sacked. <laughs> go ahead and get sacked. Uh, we're gonna go ahead though, and that's probably what I'm done showing y'all. I guess a cover three look. I've showed you guys enough. Um, I showed y'all a pretty good amount of plays against that. Now we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna go ahead and get a cover four look, man. We're gonna go ahead and do it against a cover four look. Uh, so now um, we get in cover four. We're doing a cover against a cover four looks. Uh, like I said, it's a lot of the same adjustment I like to do out of this. But what I really, 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 really if someone spamming cover four, I got y'all, man. I got y'all. Go ahead, put your fast receiver on the outside. Turn lock it. PA post shot. Y'all gonna see, man. Um, <laughs> people run cover four. This is definitely a great play, man. Definitely a great play against a cover four look. I'm just gonna show y'all what you guys can do now. I'm. A, I don't think it works if you're on the right side of the field, honestly. I think this it works if I'm already. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna find out. Cause honestly, um, yeah. Yeah, it does. Boom! Oh my goodness, Russell Wilson missed the read, but it does work even when you're on the right hash mark. You guys see how wide open that was, literally. This is the setup you guys gotta do. Get the cover four look straight up. Bomb, I'm gonna bomb you, you know what I mean? If you're gonna be a cover four, I think you could just be a cover four all game, then all right, then. Whatever you think. But as you guys can see, boom! <laughs> we just dying out here. It's too easy. Like, don't run cover four on me, man. Don't run cover four. People would, would instantly, you know, cover three, cover two bomb. Then they'll be like, all right, bet. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just cover, um, all right, bet. They'll be like, all right, bet then. They'll be like, all right, bet. <laughs> They'll be like, all right, bet. Boom. Da. Ooh. So that's basically what you're going to do against people who spam cover four. Literally all game long. No no adjustments. What not? No adjustments. Um, that's what you're going to do. PA post shop. Straight off the back. Straight off the back, man. Uh, you guys can also run out of a slot offset. It's pretty good run play. They have inside zone. You level seals. A lot of people run level seals. I'm just going to show you all real quick. Level seals is also a great something you can run. Um, you know. First read, everyone's is, is, is flats every time. <laughs> First read is always gonna be that. Now, now you don't really have to do a table on this certain, you know, this because this is already like, you know, this this play works really, really well already. You know what I mean? And we got someone with a truck. You either trucking, boom, spin, whatever the case may be. But you guys see, every time it's gonna be wide open. Every single time, this is wide open. Every single time. You know what I mean? It gets a couple four look. Most of the time, you no know, adjustments. That's wide open. I guess another couple four. I think against cover four also this works. Maybe not. I'm probably lying. We're gonna go ahead and see. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're lying. We're definitely lying. Never mind. You know, I've seen someone, I've seen someone bomb me before though, out of level seal. So I think it was a cover three beater. Um, you got this corner out. You got a lot of times now. I leave if I'm gonna run level seal. I never really do, but I, I will leave it base honestly, because you're gonna just have routes. You know, um, this is level concept right there. It's already good enough already good enough and then especially in the goal line you highball that that's it's so glitchy man i'm telling y'all this these routes are just gonna it's so annoying to playing against level still honestly because you see it all the time but it's like it's so annoying bro because you expect people not to really be running anymore and it's like people will just spam it all game and you just be like bro wow i forget how this play was really really good especially at the start of the year this play was really really you know people just love running level still like <laughs> for no reason people just love running level still and good out of this so that's basically you know um this is a little just showing y'all real quickly uh, i wish you could audible the gun but you can't audible the single back deuce close so if you got all the guys that love to run you know want to run single back deuce close and you guys are interested in this playbook hey say less y'all got hb wham um like i showed y'all started the video you guys have hb wham you know you could just wham people to death literally <laughs> literally just wham people to death man y'all know how effective wham is wham is literally the best one of the best run plays you can run in the goal line um you also have, and then you also have stretch uh i swore to god i i, I swore on everything like i literally <laughs> i literally made you know an audible where i had stretch right here i guess i guess it didn't register i was trying to show y'all stretch off the back but we're gonna go ahead i'm just gonna show you guys again you know, 
look, let's look, it's a bad stick by me, honestly. I don't really, I go run a stick like that, you know, I pass more, but <laughs> that's what you're gonna do out of this a lot of times if you're gonna be an A slot offset. Another good formation, honestly, another great formation. You guys like to run something that everyone doesn't run, that's A. A slot offset, man. I showed you how I come for bomb. Um, just once again, I'm gonna show you uh, deuce close. You got deuce close. I'm not gonna really go over deuce close because you guys already know how deuce close deuce close works. I'm just gonna show y'all like they got stretch. They got all this, you know. And that's the good thing about this plate, Seattle Seahawks. You know, deuce close. A lot of deuce close don't even have stretch. They just have wham. Stretch is very, very good out of deuce close. If you know what you're doing. Oh, <laughs> if you guys see easily already off the back. I'm getting yards. I'm getting yards just like that. Stress is very good. And then you can switch the play. People won't know which, which way you're going to be running. People literally will not know what play you're running. You're like, people will not know what play, you, what side you're running on. I said, well, people will not literally know what side you're running on, man. So that's really a good thing about this stretch play. If you guys really love to tote, then there y'all go, man. There y'all go. Uh, now we're going to just get, get out of this. We're going to go against a couple four, and that's basically going to be this video, man. Um, Make sure y'all let me know if y'all like this. I feel like I really, really uh feel a little, I just feel ruggish, you know what I mean? Because I just woke up. And it's been a lot, like I said, I've been going through, and it's been, I've just been fighting, man, honestly. I've just been fighting, uh, and it's been hard, you know what I mean? I just finally uploaded, but I'm gonna make sure I'm consistent, um, definitely consistent, man. Make sure I'm consistent. This is a uh, cover four bomb, I'm pretty sure. I haven't done it in a while. Um, do not kill me, guys, if this doesn't work. Do not kill me. Yeah, yeah, never mind. <laughs> do not kill me. Uh, I think I did something wrong right there. I think I honestly, I did something wrong. What did I do wrong? 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 I'm trying to remember. What did I do wrong? Is it this? Nah, 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 nah. I'm tripping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I just woke up, by the way. So if y'all really see how the way I'm talking and whatnot, you guys <laughs> should probably already know. But there's a lot of things I like to do, you know, instantly. Just I'll, quick hiking people as well. You know what I mean? If you guys, uh, yeah, this is one of the things we love to do, really do, is quick hike people. You know what I mean? So they don't really make adjustments and then just run this play. And you're going to always have C route most of the time wide open. That's C route most of the time. It's always going to be wide open. Especially if you lowball that. You know what I mean? Baldwin got to catch that. A lot of times I like lowball on that C route. I love lowball on that C route. So, boom. Quick hike. You can hit the flash by tie and tie. There's so many things you could do, you know, out of this play. This whatnot. These ball go literally could be hellacious. Like, <clears throat> it literally can be so hard to stop if someone could run this all games. They're just hitting every single read. They got every single read. You know, they're hitting every single thing. If something's always wide open. Because in this play, something could be wide open. You know what I mean? Every single time, something could be wide open in this play. I'm going to show y'all again, you know. Lowball. Dot. <laughs> like, 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 you got to catch that ball, but you guys are seeing how effective this is just killing cover four, you know what I mean? If they're playing cover four, just quick hike him to death. Just hit every, all, the, just hit on, just hit all, every single one. Just hit every, all this, whatever is open, make sure you just making sure you're going through your progression. Don't force nothing, you know what I mean? Make sure you go through your progression. Don't force nothing. A lot of times you could even leave this route. You could leave this route right here. Uh, right there is a dot. You know, that Seahawks is going to be always, always open every single time if that defender is going to fall for that, you know, because it's going to go towards that running back. You guys see he's going to start going towards the running back. Low ball, dot. You know, most of the time it's always going to be wide open. Long, especially if you got like a Julio Calvin, uh, Chad Johnson, Fred Belenikov, all those guys. You guys going to be Gucci, man. Um, also, though, this is not really work around against computer, but this route, this route right here by circle, it's right there. I did not mean to lob it. I meant to beam it. That's so yeah. I, I meant to beam it. So I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all again. I meant to beam that. I did not mean a lot of that whatsoever. This route will get open against users. Like this route gets open a lot of times against a user. This route gets open a lot of times against a user. Right there, I should have just lowballed that. Um, right now I'm looking kind of crazy running this. I'm looking kind of crazy right now because I'm trying to force this just to show y'all. Like I'm really trying to force this, man. As you guys can see though, boom. This route, that little <laughs> hits and go literally will mess up users so badly I it just happens so many times um then you also have mesh like I showed y'all same route combination can literally destroy cover four you know what I mean I love running this <laughs> I love running this man I love running this concept low ball dot you know every single time um you this is this like literally if there's gonna be a one-on-one -on -one coverage a corner route versus that corner you guys better take that because it's gonna be wide open like almost every single time um, that's why I literally lowballed that flats again. You know what I mean? It's 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 just simple. It's very very simple. That's literally you know stuff I do against a couple four look a lot of times. But like I said, the same outcome this I do against like a couple three look. Do it against a couple four. You know, because Ralph's always gonna end up still being wide open regardless. Regardless, man. Especially if zones are getting pulled down or whatnot. You guys have you know once again you guys have um pa pa post. You know what I mean? Uh, right there I'm just leaving a base because I'm just gonna show y'all. You, you know. There's things you could do out of this. You know, you could leave this. Cover four look a lot of times. They don't make it no. If they're not really making streaks, no adjustments, that's going to be wide open. You know what I mean? Every single time, it's going to be wide open. We're going to go ahead now, and we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and go back to good bus tight end. And we're just going to show y'all, you know, what I like to do. You know, um, inside zone, very good against cover four. 
Inside zone is very good against cover. Now, I don't know about this line. This line can hold up against it. But I don't think so. But inside zone is very good against cover four. And I just, you know, draw is very good too. But they don't got drawn in, in these formations, which sucks. You know, that's why I really don't like about this uh, playbook. You know, I don't got draw and got much tight end. So, yeah, you got to deal with that. But HB off tackle is also a great, great, great run. It's, it's, it's very, especially if you got someone that has a great fit. You can just boom, spin, you know, and then I, I don't know where you can easily score. So, that's what I really like to do. Uh, gets a couple forward look all the time. And then, you know, PA, po like a lot of times, like I said, again, PA post, uh, I like to do, uh, let's see, I like to drag this guy right here. A lot of time I like to fade just because they can pull away whatever deep blue they have and you guys are gonna see what gets wide open what's not you know I'm drag every single time it's gonna be wide open almost in any cover it can be wide open it just depends on the timing of the route literally literally drag can be wide open like literally this drag can be wide open so we're gonna go ahead I'm gonna do it again um max protect uh drag this guy fade now I'm gonna see if I can really I can hit like deep I'm gonna see if I can hit deep. um no we get insta shedded right there like crazy damn man fight for me fight for me Graham. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all. That's basically gonna be this video, though. Um, I would definitely make a longer, more precise video. I feel like I really didn't do too much out of this playbook as much. I know I I, I help people still, but like I feel like I don't know, man. I feel like I could have did way more. I, I, I'm just, you know, I just like I said, man. I'm, this has been a lot for me, and I'm just trying to, like I said, but every time, like you guys can see, that's something. Before I end this video, just pay attention to that. Pay attention, man. Pay attention to that. Right. We'll go ahead, look at the replay. Um, that's why I really love fading that guy. So, like I said, man, you guys pay attention to what I'm doing. If I'm going too fast, make sure y'all just keep replaying over a second, over something that you guys want to make sure, and just pay attention to the route combinations. For example, you guys literally can just be like, oh, yeah, for this play, I'm going to fade my tenant to pull the pull, you know, deep, the deep blues away. You guys see, that's why I faded that. And then I also have a drag so I can pull, you know, the other guy that that can, you know, pick off that other pass. And that's why he, he, he falls towards that. That's what I really love to do against any type of cover two look. Um, and that's always going to be wide open. You guys see how wide open, just low ball that. Just, you know, because guys in freaking month now are literally, all of them, are literally like flash, man. They just flash with 91 zone. They beat everyone on the field. So you guys can see, that's just dots, 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 dots. It's too easy, man. We, you know, that, that's basically going to be this video, man. We are in Seattle Playbook, uh, Seattle Seahawks Offensive Ebook, man. If you guys like this, let me know. If you guys want to see any other type of ebook, let me know in the comment section below. Green Bay is next, you know. So I got you, man. I got you, man. This guy, um, you know, my, I think his name is Monty. He's been really consistently asking about Green Bay. So I got y'all, man. I love y'all, man. This is your boy, Fizzy Hoodie. Stay with stay blessed. Peace. <laughs>